dinosaurs, dinosaurs, over there, over there. Hey cool kids, welcome to the age of the dinosaurs. It was made of three periods. The Triassic, the Jurassic, and the Cretaceous. Fun fact! I love fun facts. Is there any fun fact around here? I'm hungry. <clears throat> the Triceratops. It was around in the late Cretaceous period of the dinosaurs. It was known for its three horns. One just above the nose and the other two above the eyes. Its shield and horns were thought to be a defense against other predators and even attract their mate. The Triceratops could weigh 13,000 pounds, stand 10 feet tall, and could be 29 feet long. It lived in North America and was a herbivore. The Triceratops was also thought to have had about 554 teeth. <laughs> wow, that's a lot of teeth. This is a pentaceratops. It kind of looks like a triceratops. See, very similar, but different. The pentaceratops was also from North America and lived in the Cretaceous period. Look at that horn. One, two, three, and the ones on top of the shield. <laughs> the biggest difference between the two, Triceratops and Pentaceratops, is that the Triceratops was just a little bit bigger. But it's easy to see how they could get confused. The Pentaceratops was also an herbivore. Iguanodon. This amazing dinosaur was thought to have been 30 feet in length and lived in the late Jurassic, early Cretaceous period. It was discovered in England and then later found in other parts of Europe. The skull of the Iguanodon was narrow and beak-like. It was an herbivore. It had teeth and was able to eat through tough vegetation. Hi, cool kids. Here's another fun fact. Fun dino fact. Did you know a stegosaurus's brain was the size of a walnut? <laughs> it's true. That's why I'm the smartest dinosaur. What's my name again? Uh, where, where am I? Ankylosaurus. It is believed to have been 26 feet in length. The Ankylosaurus lived in the late Cretaceous period. It had a tail like a golf club 
and four short legs that sat close to the ground. One of the Ankylosaurus's biggest defenses was the bony plates on its back, and it had four horns on the back of its head. Just like the Triceratops and Iguanodon, the Ankylosaurus was a herbivore. It ate plants. Stegosaurus was from the late Jurassic period, and it could be 30 feet in length. It was known as the roofed lizard. It was thought that these were a defense mechanism, but now scientists believe that it helped control body temperature, and also a way to show off to the ladies to find a mate. The Stegosaurus could reach speeds of 9.5 to 11 miles per hour. The Stegosaurus could weigh 2 to 4 tons, and it too was a herbivore. It loved to eat plants. Even though the Stegosaurus plates aren't thought to be used for defense anymore, it wasn't defenseless. It had a tail with these four vicious spikes to fight off predators. Brachiosaurus is one of the largest dinosaurs. It stood almost 45 feet tall and 75 feet in length. It weighed nearly 20 African elephants, up to 100,000 pounds. The Brachiosaurus was a herbivore. Brachiosaurus means arm lizard. Its two front forearms were longer than the two hind legs. The Brachiosaurus was from the late Jurassic period and is often confused with the Brontosaurus. The two main differences between the Brachiosaurus and the Brontosaurus was really the height and weight. The Brachiosaurus was substantially bigger. Oh, hey, cool kids. Here's another fun dino fact. Did you know there are roughly over 700 dinosaur species? But I'm the coolest. <laughs> I'm hungry. The Brontosaurus was thought to be 72 feet in length and stand 26 to 28 feet tall. It too was a herbivore and it lived in the late Jurassic period. The Brontosaurus ranged anywhere from 34 to 50,000 pounds. Allosaurus was from the late Jurassic period, and it's a carnivore. It loved to eat meat. It could run as fast as 21 miles per hour to catch its prey. It had relatively long arms and three claws, and thought to have been 39 feet in length. It lived in what is now the USA and is also thought to be from Tanzania, China, and Portugal. The Allosaurus weighs anywhere from 1.5 to 3 tons. <laughs> The 
pterosaur, most commonly known as the pterodactyl, was a flying lizard. Its name meant wing lizard. The pterodactyl lived from late Triassic to the end of the Cretaceous period. This pterosaur, pterodactyl, was a carnivore. It ate meat. The Spinosaurus. It was longer and heavier than the Tyrannosaurus Rex. It is thought to have been the largest carnivore that ever existed. Its skull was nearly six feet long and the body 45 to 50 feet in length. Weighing anywhere from 13 to 20 tons. Scary, scary dinosaur. I definitely would never have wanted to run into one if I lived during the late Cretaceous period. <laughs> the first Spinosaurus was discovered in Egypt in 1912. Well, the fossils, that is. They also found fossils of the Spinosaurus in North America. The Spinosaurus is definitely one of the biggest land predators that ever lived. The Spinosaurus spine was thought to have helped it swim and used like a sail. Velociraptor for short, raptor lived during the late Cretaceous period. The movies depict them as tall as humans, but in reality, velociraptors were turkey sized anywhere from one and a half feet to like six feet in length. The velociraptor's ancestors are thought to have been able to fly, which is why velociraptors had some feathers and wings on their arms. They could run extremely fast. This carnivore, even though small, I wouldn't want to mess with. <laughs> fierce, mean, iconic dinosaur, the Tyrannosaurus Rex. For short, T-Rex. The Tyrannosaurus Rex roamed during the late Cretaceous period and was a carnivore. It ate meat. The Tyrannosaurus Rex was anywhere from 11,000 to 15,000 pounds. They could reach 40 feet in length and 12 feet height. The T-Rex had short little arms with two claws and teeth. <laughs> Mosasaurus was an aquatic lizard. It's actually not a dinosaur, but it roamed during the Cretaceous period. It's a carnivore and lived in Europe and North America in the ocean. The largest Mosasaurus is thought to have been 50 feet in length. Could swim 30 miles an hour really, really fast. It reminds me of a crocodile. Hi, T-Rex. Do you kids want to count with me? I heard the cool kids like to count.
let's count together, okay? Let's start with the numbers one through 10. Those are my favorite numbers. <laughs> All right, you ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. <laughs> Good job, yeah. I love counting. I'm a T-Rex counter. Did you make a dinosaur friend? What's the dinosaur's name? Me dinosaur. Big dinosaur. What color is the dinosaur? Green. It's green. What kind of dinosaur is it? Is it a T-Rex? Can you say T-Rex? Yeah. I'm a baby T-Rex. Yeah. Where are the dinosaur's feet? <sighs> oh, have big feet to walk. <laughs> Down. Okay. Does this dinosaur have big teeth? Yeah. <laughs> Where are they? Teeth, teeth, teeth. Dinosaur have feet. Dinosaur teeth. Do you know where my dinosaur friends are? Have you seen them? Okay. That way? Yeah. Wow. Hi, I'm Terry the Triceratops. I love to eat a lot of vegetables. But I also like to count. Do you like to count also? My favorite numbers are 11 through 20. Do you guys want to count with me? Okay. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, and 20! Yeah! Good job, cool kids! I love counting! What do we have here? Egg. Do we have a dinosaur egg? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Let's see what's inside. Now you want to brush it. Okay, brush it. Go away. Go away, dumb. Up you, up you. Okay, you want to get the Go away, baby. Okay, go away. Go away. Wow. <gasps> wow. We got our first dinosaur. Here, let's brush him. Oh, we... <gasps> more dinosaurs! More dinosaurs! Yay! Yay! <gasps> wow! Look at the Triceratops. Look at more it. More dinosaur. More. Pizza. We have an iguanodon. Yeah. Yeah. Peekaboo. Peekaboo. Hiding. They're hiding in the egg? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. How many dinosaurs did we find so far? One. Two. two three, three. Four. Five. Six. 
My daughter. And there are definitely more dinosaurs in the egg. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right, cool kids. I wanted to share my egg with you. Okay, fine. Oh, baby dinosaur. And what is this? Is this the T Rex's egg? What the egg? You want to open the egg? Okay. okay. Mommy can. Mommy can open the egg? What color is the egg? Pink. It's pink. That's right. Count with me to five. One, two, three, four, five. Wow. Look at the pink dinosaur that came out of the egg. Dinosaurs. Dinosaurs over there, over there. Dinosaurs, dinosaurs over there. Over bye, bye, everybody. Bye. 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 So much fun playing with you. Dinosaurs. I love cool lessons with. Yeah. yeah. Bye.